I love cheating. If you don't cheat, what the hell is wrong with you? Wow, that is a scalding hot take. Have you ever been cheated on? Oh, sorry. I forgot some people are in relationships. To clarify, I love to violate academic integrity on exams. What is up my aesthetic boys, it's Fresh, back with another video, this time from the classic r slash self oof by words. Now of course, I call it that and not its actual name, because if I said the actual name, YouTube would self oof me. Dating is so easy guys, you just ask someone out and they say no. Luru Hyman, intelligence is a weapon, and I am unarmed. Hearing my own voice on recording makes me want to apologize to every single person I've talked to, like I'm... I'm really sorry. From what I hear in my head, my voice sounds fine, like a moderately deep male voice. However, in recording, I sound like a ferret on crystal meth hits him helium and is doing an impression of one of the lollipop guild guys from the Wizard of Oz. Disgust me every time. We got a Tinder match. Send an animal fact. Cows have no depth perception. They think a one inch hole is a thousand feet deep. Uh, does that mean that you won't be able to tell I have a micro penis? Wait, did you just call me a cow? What's something you can say during sex, but also when you manage a brand Twitter account? Done in under four minutes. Oh, thank you, Podnoodle, for that insightful offering. Unrelated to the subreddit, what a wild time to be alive that brands like Cup Noodle, Slim Jim, and Moon Pie have successfully weaponized self-deprecating memes in order to sell more microwave noodles, processed beef sticks, and, well, Moon Pies. I can't tell if this is the worst or the best timeline. Perhaps the best one-liner in a student paper this semester. The analysis is severely limited by my lack of understanding of what I'm doing. At least they're self-aware. We got Matthew, 23, with the cool f***ing, cool f***ing ninja pose. About Matthew, when you say jump, I'll say how high, and when you say three feet, I'll reply that's too high. I only have a 34 inch vertical, so really what I'm saying is I hope you're willing to settle for two inches less than you expected. To be honest, what I'm more confused about here is why the distance on tenders and kilometers, but then the units of measurement in the phallic joke are imperial, they're in inches. Also, while looking up imperial units, I found out there's an imperial unit smaller than an inch called a barley corn, and I'm so disappointed they don't teach cool stuff like that in school. That or I, I just wasn't paying attention when they did. I'd like to start this off with a little game. You can only pick one option. I can either A, compliment you, B, roast you, or C, tell a dad joke. Ah, let's go with B, the roast. You look like the kind of guy who busts after three minutes and always says, I swear this never happens to me. Whoa, 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 three minutes? What, do you think I'm some kind of marathon man? My crush has got COVID. I think it's the best time to propose her. She might just say yes because of the lack of taste. Hey, Red Redacted, tell it to me straight. Did you swipe for me or the cow in my profile? Well, I swiped for you, but figured if you liked the cow, you'd like me. No curve here. Can we all agree on that? See, you'll never change what you tolerate. Research, hashtag Flat Earth. I love Flat Earthers because they remind me that even though I'm a failure, there are always people even more disappointing than me. Now, my first thought was to call this post out as a joke. I mean, obviously a flat earth Twitter account spouting easily disputable nonsense is doing it ironically, but after a disappointingly long time spent scrolling through their page, it appears to be an actual flat earther, as difficult as that is for me to believe. But as the commenter says, it does put things into perspectives that it could always get worse. Now I was born a man and identify as a man, but according to most meal deals, I'm a family of four. Maybe if I open up to COVID, it'll leave. Hey, this is kind of embarrassing, but I have a little crush on you. Please don't tell anyone about it though. I know you're straight, but I thought I should tell you. Well, okay then. Uh, no, I didn't mean anything bad by it. I'm actually glad that at least one person will have a crush on me in life. Why use a weighted blanket when I can sleep with the weight of not being enough? My followers on OnlyFans are paying me to put my clothes back on. Are you guys tired of being looked down on because of your bulky old wallet? It's time for an upgrade with the sponsor of today's video, Ridge Wallet. Every Ridge Wallet can hold up to 12 Amex black cards plus plenty of Benjamins and its ultra durable materials comes with a lifetime warranty. There's never been a better time to upgrade your wallet either because Ridge is doing a huge giveaway. With every dollar spent on the website before September 18th, you'll be entered to win an off-road optimized convertible 2020 Jeep Gladiator, or 50K if that's your style. Head to ridge.com forward slash fresh or the link in my description and use discount code fresh to get 10% off your order and a chance of winning a sick Jeep. That's ridge.com forward slash fresh. 
Women of Reddit, what is 100% myth about women? Well, that they're hot, single, in my area, and want to talk to me. Or even, even just the last one. Dear famous people, do you ever get annoyed of at Seth Rogen's laugh when you hang out with him? Serious question. Thanks. Yep. Uh, they do. Well, apparently not Paul Rudd because he gave him a massage, and I only found that out from a tweet on July 5th while scrolling through Seth Rogen's extensive collection of vases that he posts about on his Twitter account. This has absolutely nothing to do with the subreddit, the video, or Reddit in general, but I just thought it was a fun fact. This is the first year I'm not going to Fiji because of COVID-19. Normally, I do not go because I am poor. New challenge, find a car guy who doesn't have a buddy for every car on the market. It's me. I'm the guy that doesn't have a buddy. Uh, not just not just for cars, just just in general. I'm so lonely. I licked parts that went into a rocket that went into space. You just provided an alien race with human DNA. They have now with their advanced technology made clones of you. They're studying these clones, finding both their strengths and weaknesses, and when they invade, and we all become their slaves. Please remember that this is all you're doing. Jokes on them. I have no strengths. Hey, hey, I like your tattoos. I do not have a dog for you to pet. Sorry about that. Oh, that's so sad. Sorry, I'm only here to pet dogs, obviously. Well, this has been nice. Best I can offer is cacti. And I can't pet a cacti? It'll hurt. I like to introduce the cacti early so you get used to a little prick. And then, as the title of the post adds, she did not respond to this. Some of these feel like they're just being said for Reddit karma, which is a weird thought, but it's possible there are actually people who would prefer Reddit karma to real physical contact. Every time I think I might have hit rock bottom, someone shows me that there's always further to fall. I bet I'd beat you in solitaire, not unless you can win in under 42 seconds, my personal record. Unfortunately for you, I'm an expert in finishing in under 42 seconds. What you're apparently not an expert in is charging your damn phone. Whenever I'm feeling fat, I try not to stress about it and just keep my chins up. Jeff Bezos actually has more money than brain cells. Yeah, so do I, lol. He's not special. Student still has no sense of smell or taste after catching coronavirus in March. Yeah, if she has no sense of taste, then I'm the man for her. Yeah, I get the self-burn and whatnot, but I'd also like to point out the creepy fact that anytime there's an online article about a girl and something that happened to her, in this case, long-term side effects of COVID, at least one dude has to come around and mention something about dating her, like death taxes and Jake Paul fighting another non-boxer. Some things are just inevitable. One of the most fun to play games if you have friends to play with. Unfortunately, I don't, but I still love this game nonetheless. And then they went, uh, went all pirate at the end. 10 out of 10. 159 people found this review helpful, and 60 people found it funny. Yo, password weak. Well, so is my memory, so please let me keep it. Are you stupid? No. Why? Because there is always a you in stupid. Well, there's an I in stupid, too. Wait. Males of Reddit, how would you feel if a girl gave you a flower? Well, I'd just be glad they came to my funeral. Another one from r slash ask reddit, would you ever date a cam model who created nude and sexual content? Why or why not? Would they date me? That's the real question. Ah yes, the unpickable lock. I'll just put that next to the unsinkable ship. Shall I? Go ahead. What other unblankable things are there? Well, I'm unfuckable if that counts. What word or phrase do others use that you just can't stand? No, Paul, I'm not, I'm not interested in having dinner with you. Oh, poor Paul. Honestly, I would never go bungee jumping. A broken rubber brought me into this world. A broken rubber is not gonna take me out. You can tell who your close friends are by the nicknames they give you. The more insulting it is, the closer they feel they are to you. Yeah, my friends call me Please go away. I will call the police. I told you never to come here again. There is a restraining order. Are we besties or what? If you are attractive, something as basic as asking someone for directions can make their day. Hey, somebody just did this to me. Oh my god, wait, am I ugly? What's an occupation you're sure no one enjoys doing? Sewage diving? I actually quite enjoy browsing Reddit. Five stars, mouse works great. See, my girlfriend and I were on the verge of breaking up because I would keep her awake at night with my constant mouse clicking. Not anymore. Consider this relationship saved. The mouse is so silent, she'll sometimes forget I'm even home and invite her lover over. He's a pretty cool guy. Care to teach how exactly you made a move? Step one, be hot. Mission failed. We'll get him next time.